home now. The entire planet. How do you feel? I just went to the store a few days ago to get some flowers. I... I'm not exactly sure how it turned into this. Just go with it. Depression is at an all-time low since we put you in charge. What's depression? No anymore with you in charge, sir. Oh dear. I'm sorry, depression. I didn't mean to scare you away. I'm sure we can make some friends. <sighs> Mr. Cravings, depression isn't... Uh, depression is, is when people are really sad. It's not a person. It's a person to me. I think everyone deserves to be happy in their depression. This is exactly why we put you in charge. I'm really confused, but thank you. Anyways, first order of business. I'm really nervous about what's gonna happen with all those issues on Earth. Flashback. Hello, Germany and Japan, and China, America. What's yours? Greetings. Here, some food. No, 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 no. I don't need food that's made in China. Shut your up. What the? Go, you, you even go to so many Chinese restaurants. You move. Do you think 
we're dumb enough to believe you. Japan, chill. I don't. I do not expect you to believe without permission. I would without permission. However, I'm merely a messenger. I'm not here to force beliefs onto anyone. Instead, instead, I hope to provide information and let you all decide for yourselves. The person that I refer to has made a significant impact on many lives, and perhaps with time, you see the truth of my words. I only ask for patience and an open mind. But, a sister, we've heard so many prophecies. How do you expect us to believe this one? Yes. And with all the challenges the world is facing now, we need more than cryptic messages. What could this new God offer us? This new God is not one of destruction or dominance. Instead, he embodies the ideals of love, unity, and understanding. I speak a new age where nations can come together, not driven by fear, but by hope and mutual respect. Whether you choose to believe me or not, his influence will be felt. In other words, Philippines, new God could mean a better world. Ah, okay tayo. I've heard tales and folklore about this prophecy. Perhaps, uh, perhaps we should, perhaps this is a sign that, that we, we should all love one in another, each, one, each other. Every era has its legends. Every age has its heroes. Whether this prophecy is true or not, we must prepare. Maybe this is a sign. A sign of unity amongst us. Perhaps instead of waiting for a new God, we, we should take initiative to be better for our people and for the country. That's a wise perspective, India. Regardless of what the future holds, the message remains the same. Unity, understanding, and growth. How you interpret and act on this message is up to each and every one of you. Yay. Then we got just a, then we got just a we'll be watching closely as the assistant. But for now, I'm willing to entertain this idea. The world could use a bit more hope these days. And maybe some of my food, right China? Maybe you don't surprise me again. <laughs> that was intense. But it reminds me that, that there's more that brings us together than keeps us apart. Even if we have territorial disputes. It's true. Many tourists are often defied us, but the shared values of our people find us. We all want what's best for them. <laughs> And fighting over territory is no longer serving any of our best interests. We need a new approach. Uh, yes, how do we ensure that everyone gets equal rights? Yes, how do we ensure that people get equal rights? Perhaps we need a solution for, for justice and... for justice and freedom. What if we make the territory a shared one? Where all nations collaborate and every one of them is equal, freedom, and justice. Why didn't you recommend that before? I know how. Good point. Here's a starting point for the treaty. This document could outline the rights and responsibilities for all involved nations, ensuring the principles of equality, justice, and freedom are upheld in the disputed territory. <laughs> okay. This is breaking down, yo. This is groundbreaking. This is groundbreaking. A territory that rather than dividing us, it merges us together. It's not just a treaty. It's a testament of a new age. Thank you.
So then the day was saved thanks to America, China, Japan, India, Germany, and the Philippines. And also the assistant himself.